all right everyone welcome back to more horizon zero dawn okay so here we are a couple of things happened after the last episode um i got both the tall necks so now the whole map is open uh we are going to into the frozen land no we are going to because that's level 14 uh, oh, Maker's End is all the way up there, so we'll have to go there. Let's at least get started, and uh, I'll see you back when we are near that area. Maker's End. Not much farther now. Bolin said he found an image of a woman I resemble on an ancient device. If she's my mother, why would there be traces of her all the way out here? So far from the world land. Ugh, I don't get it. Who is she? Her name is Elizabeth Sobek. You spying through my focus again? Yep, he is always doing that. Well, go on. What do you know about her? Stay on your present course, and before long, you'll know her as well as I do. Maybe better, but be wary. Maker's end is crawling with Eclipse troops. To help you deal with them, I've left some useful equipment just outside the ruins. Your focus will show the location. So he has left some stuff for us. He said Elizabeth Selbeck. What kind of name is that? Hmm, there is a new side quest here. Let's pick that up, even if we don't do it. Ah, uh, it must be Neil. He wants to take on the bandit camp. Must be him. Yeah, it is him. You will find this dude everywhere near the bandit camps. Hey, dude. Um, I waited for you. Time passing pulls the anticipation tight as wire. Ah, oh, how many has it been now? I don't keep count, no. Don't keep count? Sometimes I just don't <laughs> get you. Are you like us or a little different? Hopefully a little different. Mm, that's what you're going to tell yourself. Shall we get started? Okay. Now, uh, you wait here. I will go through that area. In fact, I will avoid that area and directly go there. So where is my marker? <clears throat> Look at this. This used to be a massive facility. Might be able to take them out one by one if I stay out of sight. Ancient Wind Dissolver, Maker's End. Oh man, it's a huge area. And we'll have to go through it. So, we should get uh, whatever he was, his stash, and then save, and then make our way through. Oh, his stash is here somewhere? No, that's, that's the second point. Good that I uh, noticed you before I started running in there. Corrupted watchers. Acting as guards. The eclipse and corrupted machines. Cooperating. We saw that before. You should not be surprised. I hear a big guy. Maybe there is a corruptor or something. Eclipse, just like he said. Okay, we got one. How about you? Got a second one. Um, there was a, there was a, um, tutorial mission 
where it wanted to uh, kill multiple enemies with a single blast bomb i don't know if that will work or not um blast bomb do we have a blast bomb yes we do so should we try that out forged dirt delvers made off with any riches long ago but not the ancients buried in the ground Okay, that worked out. I will move back a little bit because they will start start searching for me. Getting soaked from that. Okay, got that guy. The other guys are still running. I have not marked the watchers. There were two of them. Nicely done. How about you? Why are you not marked? Okay. Gotta get the demons raised before the ground freezes again. Come on, dude. Can I call that guy? That watcher? Because that will be good. <laughs> Yeah, I don't see anything else. that back on make a send uh, let's do a quick sweep so that we can see if we are missing anyone uh, no we are not okay there is a whole lot of uh, boom boom going on around we don't know what it is. Um, mm -hmm. There were some loot here. Doesn't sound good. Oh, there are more of them. Ah, there is our corruptor. There is quite a lot of them here. Where did our dude go? Okay, that's one. Very, oh, that's a corrupted watcher. We'll call the other watcher when he's here. Um, that's a watcher. That's a cultist. That's a cultist. That's a cultist. Let's see if he comes. I hope we can get up. Yes, we can. Okay. Now, who else is here? There is that watcher, that watcher, and these guys. 
Okay. Thank God that worked out. But now they are on high alert. Come here alone, dude. Finally, that thing is out. Oh. oh, what is that? Snow chill, it just can I get this guy? Suddenly getting caught by this guy did not uh, did not bode well. Okay, at least there is not much left to these guys. Oh, he's running around. You looks like I'm clear. Okay. Those are two watchers.
the other one returned come on dude what are you waiting there for oh there are more folks i heard i heard someone anyway I hurt someone. Okay, we are going this way. Hopefully it saves. clips oh more rat at least that was an awesome shot it's going to be a boss fight okay here we go Shit, these guys know about me now.
shit, who is shooting at me? You, you. This thing is almost dead. Fighting a uh, uh oh, So this one only had like half of health or one quarter of health and that itself gave me this much trouble especially because I was not expecting I did not set up to fight for it fight it <sighs> We used up all of our health potions How do we get up there? Oh, there was a ladder here. Yeah, I need more health potion. Flax <laughs> line cast is not useful for us. Anyway. Yeah, this thing has given us quite some trouble. And soon enough, I think... Oh, oh, oh. Regis shock corruption. And we are using a... Ah. What is that? We have killed the cultist and the dead bringer. Yes, we did. Are you not dead? Wait, who went down? Oh, oh, oh. there was one cultist <laughs> left can there. See them. They can't see you. Okay. You you are standing over there, so can I shoot you? from here That's it. Okay. Did it. Those things pack a punch. All right. The eclipse officer had a focus. Let's see what's on it. Don't use this focus. We don't know I'm about Hades yet. What? What is this? The entity lives. Unacceptable. 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 Did you see that? No answer, huh? Figures. Things just keep getting... I need to find a way inside the tower. Hold for identiscan. No, it didn't work. Wait, it did. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. Please step inside. Arrow automated solution. Search for information. Please proceed to the 35th floor. 
Wait, wait, wait. 350,000? That's hundreds of years ago. Exactly. Thousands of years ago. Uh, 1,000 years. Close to 1,000 years at least. Um... We don't know the story yet. The protocols use polyphasic entangled waveforms. Quantum encryption, black court stuff, way beyond military grade. That's what you demanded. So that's what we delivered. You don't code something you can't crack. All we need is a backdoor. Upload the latest service pack update and the problem goes away. You specifically forbade us from leaving anything resembling a backdoor in code. Every protocol to Black Quartz standard. Your words. Look, if you need me to fudge some projections, it's nothing we haven't done before. I don't need fudged projections. I need a way to reassert control over the Hearts team or swarm. I don't know what to tell you, Ted. You're asking the impossible. So, codes. They needed codes of some kind to control the machines but they got out of control yep sounds bad so they they created sw a swarm and then they lost control of it and they could not gain control of the swarm oh another massive room but we'll check here before we proceed because we we want the story what really happened is there anything over here i don't see anything anything that can give us answers yeah nothing shows up in scan so let's continue. Deathbringer. Or a statue of one, anyway. A machine built to kill. And they honored it? Welcome to Feral Automated Solutions, where all the problems of tomorrow are being solved today. With over 25,000 human employees based in nations and corporate holdings across the globe, Faro leads the world in every sector of self-sustaining, fully automated technology. From revolutionary consumer products close to home, like the Faro Focus, to the dynamic chariot line of peacekeeping robots halting bloodshed in conflict zones across the globe, Faro remains committed to making the future smarter, brighter, safer, and always surprising. Faro Automated Solutions. For every problem of life, a smart solution. So they made the focus. 25,000 people? That's bigger than a tribe. Yeah. So they made machines and devices. I guess those things were common in their world. That's not the problem. They made the automated ones. And then reception log. Field command uh, Indo-Malaysian. So these have like more. Oh, they had uh, contracts everywhere. Problem was not that they were what making robots. Place? What were they doing here? It was a corporation. A group of people, not unlike a tribe. And they made machines. Yeah, go on. I've uploaded some data files to your focus. They'll help you understand. Elizabeth Sobek, born March 11, 2020. Oh, 2056, 2053 Nobel Prize. Ted Faro, Theodore Ted Faro, born December 24, 2013. He was the owner of Faro Automated Solution. And military contractor. Corpor corporation. Corporation. Okay. 
থেকে ডেফিনিশন অফ কর্পোরেশন Okay, let's move forward. We are getting bits and pieces of the story slowly. Is there anything in there? Ah, this is a big room. Ah, uh, surprising there is nothing here. So Pharaoh wanted robots without back doors. and they created swarms of them and then they lost control that's that's all we know till now the air there's no smell to it not even old death nothing natural we need to go that way but there is a path over here not path just a a nook Okay, something over here. Complaint. Hey, reception is that your real name? Reception. Want to know who she scheduled into Indo Malay right next to Fresh Grounds? That would be me, senior VP of Sales. Want to know why? After that little hair pulling incident, both sides increased their bids by forty percent. So they just wanted more money. So they essentially uh, created a conflict between. Uh, uh, between india and malaysia and this guy is actually taking a tone with the receptionist because receptionist didn't think that it is ethical Oh, that was the dead bringer. So now, where where do we go? Oh, we need to go up, but how? Um. Oh, there is a. Looks like I can climb here. Hey, okay. uh, we need to climb on this one. Yeah, I'm making slow progress, but this is going to be a one-hour video. So this will probably be maker's end from beginning to beginning to end. Hopefully there are no more fightings. So that's why we need to go. But there is a whole area here. The ACA3 Scarab combines conventional and information warfare capabilities in one package, designed for high-speed all-terrain reconnaissance. It boasts the world's highest survivability rating of any scout class autonomous agent. Maybe it's the Scarab's emergency biomass conversion systems that ensure it always makes it back to base, even if fuel supply lines have been interdicted. Or maybe it's the Scarab's ability to slave enemy robots to its own network. Now that's force multiplication. Add a prehensile manipulator arm that can handle a host of functions. from 360 degree less lethal riot management to surgical repairs of allied chariot line models and you've got the workhorse of any cutting edge peacekeeping fleet the corruptor yeah slave enemy robots to its own network it sounds like it's talking about how it corrupts machines exactly so they made the corruptor and they made it uh, um Convert biomass. The B O R seven Horus. Imagine your complete engagement ecosystem comprehensively managed by a high-speed learning machine network. Whether your need is to replace battlefield losses or intensify force projection, the Horus's onboard manufacturing capabilities mean you'll never get stuck waiting for the next arms delivery. Simply redefine your force parameters, and the Horus will fabricate additional units. to fill the ranks for an affordable per unit licensing fee. Meanwhile, the biomass conversion systems of other biomass chariot models allow them to keep the Horus fueled, repaired and ready. 
extending its operational tolerances beyond that of any competing Titan-class platform. That's the Horus advantage. Always regulating, always ready. The future of automated warfare made real today. The Metal Devil. So these were far machines too. you ever stop them exactly that probably is what happened the fsp5 kopesh provides a one-size-fits-all solution to main battle force capability metamaterial construction delivers unmatched recoil dampening allowing you to field any weapon package that conforms to your budget needs and conflict resolution profile Patented biomass conversion systems allow extended emergency operations with minimal environmental impact. Multilinear target processing provides simultaneous real-time threat analysis and legal review for autonomous domestic operations. Or control can be slaved to the swarm's neural network for weapons-free force application. Either way, when it's time to call out the big guns, it's time to call Kopesh. The Deathbringer. So this was the heavy hitter. Main battle force indeed. Deathbringer. So we we came to know about the Titan, the Deathbringer, and the Corruptor. Let's make a move. So I know the story, but the thing is, uh, I want to keep the whole story in the videos so that it makes sense to anyone who watches these videos. If if anyone does watch, no one watches my videos. But still, I want to make the videos thinking that someone will watch. Since the began when they engaged in unauthorized offensive operations against robots and human personnel of the Hearts Timor Energy Combine. Now I wish that I could relate that the crisis has been exaggerated, but it's not. The peacekeepers have not responded to stand down coats and by all signs, they appear to be replicating at a precipitous rate. Now, what I can promise you, can absolutely assure you, is that I am already devoting every possible resource towards reaching a speedy conclusion to this issue. So when you hear the bad talk about us against this company in the days, maybe weeks to come, just bear in mind that we will get past this. And a day's coming when none of this will matter. Peacekeepers. That's what they called their machines. They were built for war, not peace. Exactly. And they got out of hand. That's how this whole thing happened. Um. Talk to trap tool. Is there going to be a massive fight up there? Where are we going? We are going this way. And a very roundabout way of going to the top floor, it looks like. Banda C incident. Another problem to add to our big steaming pile. Apparently, a fisherman in the Banda C captured video of Heart Steamer Horus unit refueling via bio biometer conversion along the shoreline of Palau Water on a pod of endangered dolphins, no less, quite possibly the last of their kind. Not to get graphic, but it looked like what happened happens inside a blender, as if the robot was whipping up a big pink. Yeah, what did you guys expect? So their robots were eating anything it could get. Um, when you made such robots, what did you expect? That's what my question would be. How naive will you have to be? It, it's not naivety or naive. All it takes is a few good handholds. It's essentially greed. More money. All right, made it. There it is, power cell. Some kind of power cell. I wonder what it's for. Didn't we? Yeah, find a use for the power cell. Don't we have two of these? No. Uh, 
we only have one so we need to get all all of them we must have missed them because they all are related to main quest and all of them together lead to uh, a badass armor that i know okay let's go down and get our story the final part of it that data has been erased from this device do you wish to deploy item privileges to recover purge data oh yes i believe i do a file has been recovered one file has been recovered Good to, uh, it's been years. Where's your legal team, Ted? No need. I dropped all 18 lawsuits the moment you landed. I assume your daddy confirms this. All right, this promises to be interesting. Perhaps we could have lunch brought in. You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. You've screwed something up, something big, or you wouldn't have eaten the crow necessary to get me here. Exactly. So spit it out. There's a glitch in the chariot line. You're a killer robots? Peacekeepers, yes. Those. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me a swarm has gone rogue, Ted? It's worse than that. So every swarm has gone Show rogue. Me the data then. And I'll take that lunch alone. Did follow Ted somehow Fro brought Elizabeth Sobek here, but they hated each other. Another file has been recovered. Ah, oh, shit. This isn't a glitch, it's a catastrophe. Fully aware. It's bad. Bad? Jesus, Liz. It's not bad, Ted. It's apocalyptic. You built a line of killer robots, peacekeepers. That consume biomass as fuel. In emergencies. And you made them capable of self-replication. Limited, self-manufacture, controlled. Not anymore. The glitch severed chain of command. The only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. You, you think I did? Everything else is just food. And at the rate it's replicating, Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. We're not talking fall of civilization. We're talking extinction. I get it, Liz. So how do I stop it while it's contained? It's not contained! It can't be! You know what I mean! Right. Before the truth gets out, you mean. Liz, I will do anything you say. Keep working it, and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. The Faro robots threatened all life on Earth, but somehow she defeated them. The world of the Old Ones fell, but life went on, or we wouldn't be here. A final file has been recovered. Final file. Project Zero Dawn. Jesus, Liz. There has to be another way. If there are a nicer way to fix your mess, I would have proposed it. But this? This? When I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's not, Ted. It may be grim, but it's our only chance. Now sign the proposal. Sign it? I can't sign that. Yes, you can. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. What good conscience? You, you don't have Ted. a you don't have a I conscience. I am speaking to you from a VTOL en route to US Robot Command. In 15 minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? what? Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Or don't sign, and I will make sure they and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Jesus, Liz. You don't have to threaten me. She had to. You are an asshole. I'll sign. We will know more of how much asshole he is. Look on the bright side, Ted. 
From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others get their hands dirty. God forgive me. What made her solution so terrible? What did she do to stop the robots? What is Express lift opened. Express lift opened. Okay, exit the ruin. Hopefully that will be faster. <laughs> this, this doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been my mother. She lived ages ago. All this searching and I'm still no closer. That's your reaction to everything you've just learned? To whine like a spoiled child? <sighs> you should really try talking that way to me face to face. As you wish. Do you really have no idea how monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. So, you have a face. Got a name to go with it? Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. <laughs> I've spent decades searching the ruins of the old ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. For years, I've suspected that feral robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. And in minutes, you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime, and what you want to know is my name. Silence. That's my name. Silence. Why don't you try asking another question? Something less trivial. You have no idea what I've been through. How hard it's been. My whole life, I grew up not knowing who I am or where I came from, and then come the Eclipse trying to kill me just because I look like this Elizabeth Sobek woman. And they killed the man who raised you and you found in the mountain as a baby. I already know this through your focus. The point is, every time I take a step forward, the answers slip farther from my grasp. <sighs> you just don't understand. It's not that I don't understand, Aloy. It's that I don't care. If the answers keep slipping away every step you take, then you best start running to catch up. Maybe then you'll realize just how big your problems really are. What exactly are you talking about? You've chased a personal riddle into a crowd of larger mysteries. The common thread is your connection to Elizabeth Subic. But what is that connection? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. We don't know the connection yet. The only way to find out is to keep going, to keep making discoveries. Thanks to you, we've only just now learned that Pharaoh robots once threatened to end life on Earth. But it didn't happen. The Old One's civilization was destroyed, but life... life was saved. Obviously. So... What did Elizabeth do? How did she stop the robots before all was lost? What was Project Zero Dawn? Exactly the question. Now... Are you ready to go get the answer? Of course I am. Then why are you still standing here? <laughs> I Not have so questions. Fast, Silence. You've got some explaining to do. I've told you quite enough. If you still got questions, be quick about it and stop wasting my time. You said you've known for some time that Faro War Machines destroyed the civilization of the Old Ones. The evidence pointed that way. But until now, I never knew the full scope of their danger. That they could process organic matter into fuel, or that the Horus class could manufacture more robots. Like a cauldron on legs. But the robots we've seen so far, the Corruptors and Deathbringers, they don't do those things. Not yet, anyway. So far, we haven't encountered any that are undamaged. At full power, who knows what they're capable of. Now, if that's enough talking, be on your way. Oh, no. I'm just getting started. You've been getting a free ride on my focus, <laughs> risking nothing while I risk everything. All I have to do is take this thing off my head. Exactly. And you'll be blind, deaf, and dumb. So quit complaining and answer my questions. Very well. <laughs> Proceed. Who are you, Silence? And what are your intentions? You really need to make this 
personal. I'm a lone wanderer who left his tribe behind a long time ago. An explorer of forbidden places, a searcher of lost knowledge. Exactly as I said. Why do you know so much about the Eclipse? I happen to know a lot about a lot of things. If what you're really asking is whether I work for the Eclipse or anyone else, I don't. I am nothing if not independent. You've been using my focus to spy on me. How is that possible? Every focus emits a signal, a voice, that only other focuses can hear. I know how to string those voices together, how to make them talk to each other, to communicate, even over vast distances. How do you learn to do that? Years of study and experimentation. In principle, it's not so different from how you override machines. I override focuses. And you can spy through other Eclipse's focuses, too. Usually. All I'll say is that overriding the connections is... complicated. So far as I can tell, the Eclipse are just following orders. It's Hades who wants me dead. Who is he? I don't know. The Eclipse describe him as a buried shadow, some kind of devil. That thing that spoke to me outside, that made that focus explode. That was Hades. It, it didn't seem like a person or a machine. More like a phantom, with a terrible voice. All that's certain is that he wants you dead. Because of my connection to Elizabeth. Has to be. Hades is using the Eclipse to resurrect feral robots. But if Elizabeth found a way to stop them centuries ago, if she made special weapons, maybe Hades is worried I'll do the same thing. In some of the ancient data I've recovered, there are hints of so-called super weapons being developed. Maybe to stop the robots, the civilization of the old ones had to destroy itself. Is there any chance that Elizabeth Sobek could still be alive somehow? It's highly unlikely, but not impossible. Some of the ancient data I've recovered includes mentions of life extension techniques. Pharmaceuticals, mostly. An ancient word for medicine. But some were still trying to perfect ways of freezing and unfreezing people. Freezing and unfreezing people? Cryogenics, they called it. But there were problems with it. Given Elizabeth's technological acumen, I can't definitively rule out that she found a way to make herself immortal. But this is speculation. Wasting time. Elizabeth told Ted Faro she was headed for a place called U.S. Robot Command to tell people about Zero Dawn. The place still exists as a ruin. The Asaram call it the Grave Horde. Grave Horde? Cheery name. You'll find it in the Eastern Mountains, buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil, or a BOR-7 Horus, rather, as we're learning to call them. I'll contact you when you get there. I can't wait. Someday we'll meet in person, and your manners had better be in <laughs> Exactly. Well, getting down will be a lot faster than getting up here, at least. U.S. Robot Command next to learn the secrets of Zero Dawn. The Grave Horde. The snow sets in quicker than frost. Learn, learn the ancient frost. Okay, so we are over here and Greyboard is all the way over there. Basically next to the the frozen void. So let's quickly check.
think we should take this because these two will take okay so we will get back to um the side missions there is a bandit camp for level 20 um there is a uh, into the frozen wilds or, or this area and collateral that that we can do um Yeah, collateral is level 20. That probably is what we should do. Uh, or into the borderlands level 15, we can we can complete that. So into the borderlands will be close by, right over here. Uh, let us do that by going over here. So that's what we'll do in the next episode. Hopefully you guys are liking it. If you did like it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you with the next episode. Game Changer X out.